Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to part 35 of Let's Play The Surging Storm, where we are about to defeat another army of the uh, douchebaggy, uh, um, what's it called? Um, uh, the Dornish, because, uh, well, they, uh, you know, while I was just minding my own business in my own city, they decided to attack. Like the wank pheasants they are. So we're going to defend ourselves from them quickly um, as we are going to go take Tumbleton back. Uh, we will take Tumbleton back after I've um, defeated this army, basically. We do have more cavalry. We have more cavalry on one flank. I'm going to add the mounted archers to that flank just to make sure we've got a little bit more on that flank as well. And we do have a lot of archers, so we do need to make sure we make use of that. We also have a lot of infantry, in quotation marks. Our uh, range units, though, 5 to 1 against her, so that's good. They won't really give us the chance to use them, but... I'm going to make sure my cavalry intercepts the enemy cavalry straight away to make sure they, the, any, the, 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 you know, the central part of the battle is going to be a little bit more... Not fairer. Fairer is the wrong word, but to make sure it's kind of like a little bit more clear-cut. You know, no cavalry involvement on either side for now. So their cavalry does seem to be drawing first blood, which is a little annoying. Yeah, given how many men you have, we have, you think our... Uh, I think our archers would be doing a lot better, but they don't seem to... I don't know what it is, but archers in Realm of Thrones do not seem to do that much. They, they do seem to be, like, generally very shit. Like, I, I feel like I have far more luck with archers in any other, like, mods. Like, Realm of Thrones archers, not Realm of Thrones. Um, the, the Eagle Rising archers are amazing. Even the base ones, like the base ballistas uh, or the uh, auxiliary archers are amazing. Like, they actually do what they, you know, you expect them to do. They, they, they kill. They shoot at a good range. Like, even base game fucking archers do great. But for some reason in this, like, even the best archers don't seem to do that good. They, they seem to be very limited in range. They don't seem to be able to actually do much when they get into combat. They seem to just essentially be in the way. Now, the Mirish, uh, the Mirish crossbow might be the only one where I, I just, I might have to, you know, have a different opinion, but... Yeah, for the most part, Infantry! it's, uh, I don't know how to say it, but yeah, they're just, they don't seem very, you know, they just seem a bit shit, you know? And that's fine, but it's just, you know, I, I kind of expected, I, I kind of like more from them, especially the Knight's Watch archers. They have, if they, unless they've changed it, I haven't, you know, played up there and, uh, since the stream I did last year. But they were... Their archers are shit. They have to be, like, within 140 meet, uh, meters. Whereas normally, like, archers will start sh taking pot shots at, like, 200 plus. Um, they won't be... They won't be accurate, but, like... And also, when they hit, they'll actually do damage. Whereas these archers in the base game... Oh, sorry, this just seem to do nothing. So if um, any of the mod makers are watching, please do let me know what I'm missing. If I'm wrong or if there is a reason for it, I'd like to know. It could be that they, you know, nerfed archers to make sure archers weren't as OP as they are in, you know, in the base game. And uh, that would be a very understandable reason. But at the very least, I'd like to know if they are, if any mod, uh, any of the mod developers are, you know, watch my stuff. If you, also, if you watch my stuff, thank you. That's just, just really nice of you. Consider becoming a channel member. Obviously, I'm being sarcastic. So if people do are interested in channel memberships, there will be new. There will always be at least one or two channel series going on. There may not always be what I make on the main channel in terms of, you know, battle and stuff like that. But it'll be stuff that I'm enjoying. Like hopefully you guys will enjoy watching me play. So you know, channel member stuff is essentially uh, content that is how to phrase it quickly so I'm not wasting time in the video. It's essentially stuff that I want to play in my spare time, and instead of sp playing in my spare time, I'm going to record it so that way there's more ch content for the channel and you know. You guys are, uh, you know, still getting a bunch of cool stuff. And... Wait. Oh, shit. She actually... All right, fuck you, then. You can have the siege. I'm gonna go take a bit of bridge back, then. Damn it. Already escaping my pie. Wankers. Um. Oh, wow. A load of people are just escaping right now. Uh, Fervent attacker, definitely. 
Ooh, there's an army there. An army that's being built. You've leveled up. Get that up. Oh, no, it's 400 strong. Oh, come here. Oh, you little pussy. It's been... Sucks to be you, shitface. Let's do this. So we call this dick shit off, uh, off guard. Oh, we have 200 archers. That's amazing. I love having archers. Archers are legitimately one of my favorite units in pretty much any game. Like Total War, I love having archers. Um, as anyone who watches me play Total War and knows, I love archers. Uh, which is why Armor Mass is probably one of my favorite campaigns, purely because he's like, yes, here's some extremely bullshit level archers. Congratulations, you know, you're basically a god. Fuck my life, that's not what I meant to press. Disappear, all of you. Go. Yeah, do not fucking follow me. That's the opposite of what... Why are they coming towards me? Yes, I'm not aware why they're coming towards me. Oh, it's because they're basically just cavalry. Soldiers! Horsemen! Fuck it, I have a good amount of archers. We're gonna take this. We're gonna, you know, we're gonna do something I wouldn't normally do, and I'm just gonna let my men skirmish. Fuck it. Archers! Archers! Yeah, so so far the enemy are at 200. Which isn't, you know, that far away. Like, so they're 165, and none of them are facing that way. Fuck me. I'm just gonna have to charge. Like, I don't have a choice because they're getting too close. And also, I think their cavalry is probably too heavily armored for my uh, to my archers to really do much against anyway. Right. Yeah, their cavalry is their throwing weapons that are causing my cavalry a bunch of problems. I think. Take away the front line from them and whatever else we can kill, and then we'll just uh, leave the rest of the job to my cavalry. All right. I think that's. Uh... Oh, they've got reinforcements. Why? Can't you just? Why can't you just deploy all of your men at once? I do need to look for a mod that increases battle size. Or if anybody who has is in the modding scene, if you want to make a mod for me that like, increases the battle size, it's 1500 or 2000, please let me know, because I'd be interested in that mod. It would be a mod that I would essentially call a mainstay of my channel, because I like the idea of bigger battles. Especially because, like, you know, so in some battles, you can be really fucked over by the game in terms of, like, you just get deployed, you know, even though you have more men, you like, they'll, like, in some sieges, you'll only get 250. Even though, you know, they have like 600, sorry, seven, they'll, they'll, they'll get 750 if they have 1,000, you'll get 250. Whereas I feel like it'd be cooler if we could both get a grand in, or like I get 500 to their 1,500 would be cool. I don't know why I want to see battles that big. I just think my computer could handle it, and I think it'd be hilarious to like, you know. It would also make the game far more difficult in some aspects, which I do think is necessary. It was also nice to finally get a level up again. I've been waiting. Uh, probably going to level up my, uh, you know, my ability to build stuff because we want to make sure we're building uh, siege equipment so fast that nobody can stop us. Yeah, you, you guys still got him before he got off the map. There we go. Wankers. All right, you're off the map now, good. We are, I, I get enough, enough. All right, we'll quickly take this fucking siege. And then we'll, uh, you know, at that point, we'll go home once we've taken this. Just keep leaving loot behind. I'm just very upset with myself now, leaving loot behind. It's honestly, it's a travesty. And we really don't have enough troops to continue, like, up at this pace. I think I might be able to outbuild Britta Bridge, which would be, would be nice. Which means I could actually just, you know, very quickly siege it and not have to pay attention. Yep, put that there. Yeah, I can out... Well, no, I can't outbuild, but I can build quick enough that I have a single thing that it matters. 
Have they taken Tumbleton? Good, they have. I do not want Tumbleton. Could have guessed they were going to give it to me, to be fair. I am uh, kind of currently on their, like, list of must-give shit to. Oh, yeah, Jack, you leveled up. Nice one. Build that. Get more sieging. Get more sieging. As soon as we get through this, uh, I'm going to be very happy. Do not care. Ten troops. Cool. Done. Don't want any prisoners. I'm good. I will, of course, take the loot, though. All right, Tumbleton, I want to defend just because I'm sick of them taking it. Where the fuck are they getting all these troops? And no, the worst thing is nobody's actually nearby to help me. Yes, give me a bit of bridge. Fine. I'm just going to hand it off to some other douche anyway. All right. All right, Tumbleton, give away. Yes, don't care who has it. Not my problem. That's right, give it to my uh, father-in-law. Sure. A uh, bit of bridge. Don't care who gets it. Just not me. It's essentially my opinion of it. As long as it's not me, not fast. Right. They're attacking. Fuck's sake. Hundred and fifty-two. Screw it. Still have to do. Let's go in. <sighs> Fine. Give me Stony Sept, which we again have lost for some fucking reason. Yeah, I cannot seem to keep. Uh, we cannot. We cannot seem to keep anything. It's like a permanent trading. How many bloody uh, vassals of uh, not vassals? How many? Um, yeah, prisoners. We've got forty-two prisoners, and they keep shitting out more people to fight us. Honestly, getting quite ridiculous. Under my troops, look so move. Okay, yeah, we have like move, no infantry, away. which is hilarious, really. Move, horsemen, move, troops forward. No, no, not you, forward. you idiots there. Move, riders, move, soldiers forward. Oh, cool. The veil units aren't actually mine to command. Cool, that's fine. Uh, we have more infantry than them. Oh, sorry, more ca uh, cavalry than them, but don't really think that's gonna fucking matter, to be honest. Yep, best thing we can do is just attack with everyone at this point um, and get this done. Because they're chucking a lot of troops into our uh, front line and they're. Uh, I think I might have put my cavalry a bit too far away to immediately get involved, but, you know. Well, such is life, isn't it, really? It's always nice to get rid of a bunch of cavalry quickly. What matters? Uh, you still a Royce leveled up? Beautiful. My wife leveled up. Get rid of uh, all of you idiots over there. Okay, the enemy horsemen are pretty much destroyed. Um, good. I guess those shitheads out of my way. Now, I'm just going to go delete the rest of their units. I really don't care about this battle take. I don't care about this battle being a squash match. I just want them gone. I need them off the map so they're, you know, not annoying me anymore. I don't think I can actually, you know, I'm going to try and uh, lance with this. I want to actually, you know, I'll, ne I'll never know because, you know, I... <coughs> I need a lot of archers. Can you, like, not? Right, that's all of you gone. Okay, I can't use my fire breath. That's fine. Didn't want to use it anyway. They still have 400. Oh, my fucking God. 
They have 300. Where are they? Where are this? Is this 300? Oh, it's literally there. I know. I see it now. Cool. <laughs> the little hills in this is really annoying because it means I can't always use my breath attack when I want to. All right. It's okay. Those uh, those dipshits over there are going to die. All right. You know what we need? We need more clans. That's what we need. I need to somehow get more clans for the, uh, the veil. Because then their dumbasses can have the shit I don't want, and I can have the shit they, de they don't deserve. Right. After this battle, we are going to go back to, um... Uh, we're going to go back home, finally, and just, you know, go about our business. You know, do a little bit of smithing again. Finish what I was doing smithing-wise. And then we're going to, um... You know, actually, you know, we'll do our army first, then we'll do smithing. Because right now, we are very low on troops, which is actually a problem. Because we don't really have the ability to fight much anymore. We have, like... We have currently got 99 deployed, which is not good. We are in the, in the, yep, skin prison, don't the, care. Your sob stories do not matter to me. Get lost. There you go. Cool, thank you. Alright. So we'll do we'll do what we do best. We'll kick out all these idiots here. And then we'll go from there. Alright. Uh, one thing I want to try, though, is there any de independent clans? I don't think there's any we know, though. That Yeah, we'll just leave it. There's, I'm going to say there's probably... Oh, for fuck's sake. You know what? I have decided that that is no longer my problem, and I'm going to just take myself to every settlement... Um, I'm going to quickly go to Weeping Town to drop off um, the prisoners, and then we're going to go from there. If we lose settlements while we're away, that's fine. I really don't care. I have I need to, you know... It's only those three, right? It's, I don't. I didn't have any... No, I don't. Cool. Yeah, just making sure that that's right. Yes, Weeping Town. Yeah, you're a... Uh... Yep, that money's just going to sit there or that I, uh... Wasted would be the understatement of the year. 29 prisoners there. So we are responsible for most of the prisoners, which is... Oh, for fuck's sake, Joe. Like, I know I'm, like, needing troops. I'm not needing troops that fucking badly, damn it. I'll take eight knights of the Vale, though. And I'll take, um... They don't have any, uh... Of... Yeah, they don't have any other troops to add to that, which is fine. Eight more knights. Eight knights of the veil is good for us anyway. All right, so let's quickly now just... Actually, well, one second. I need to go chuck. Go to the keep. Go to... Yeah, go to my stash. Uh, chuck that in. Chuck all that in as well. Chuck all those in. All right, we need to sell some stuff. So let's do it. Uh, right. So will you buy a bunch of... Uh... Oh, they only have fucking war mounts here. Typical. Bloody typical. I'm assuming we've... No, we haven't already lost Tumbleton. That's Tumbleton. That's a fucking... That's impressive that we haven't already lost Tumbleton. Yeah, we're going to go to every one of these uh, along our way, and then we're going to, you know, obviously pick up all of our shit uh, troop-wise and sell everything. You know, it's going to be a long little bit. Ooh... Yes, call to arms. Make sure people move to us club quicker. That's going to be really goddamn useful for us because we are, unfortunately, having to chuck randoms into our army more often because of this. I'm 
going to very quickly pick up some pitchfork, pick, pitchforks as well. Um, and then back to selling this. Um, buy the wood because we'll need it. You have seven normal mounts. Good. We are overburdened. That's fine. We'll sell half of that and half of you. We'll then buy the other stuff that we don't have any of, really. And then back to selling, you know, crap. Oh, thank you. Uh, we'll go to these two villages as well. Again, I just want my uh, vassals to have troops. Don't really care what troops they have. All right now, it's time for us to actually pick up stuff that I want. It'll take a little bit, but you know we'll have we'll have an army pretty soon. Fuck you, Hedge Knight. I wish I could recruit you, but you're not the right troops. So unfortunately, it's a big L from me to that, and. You know, it is what it is. Um, what are we looking like strength-wise? That's something I need to check again quickly. Okay, we technically are stronger than Dawn, but Dawn has more... Uh, Dawn has more people, which means they essentially they are better off than we are. You know, they have a lot more things to recruit from. They can recruit better. They, they're At the moment, they're just kind of in a better position than we are. We're only about, yeah, we're not even, we're not even halfway to having a full army yet. We're definitely going to lose a lot of land while I do this. The problem is, it's unfortunately necessary. We'll take those quickly because, you know, very important to, uh, you know, get rid of. You have horses. You have seven normal mounts, me. You absolute legends. So a little bit of wood as well and all these other food types. Yeah. I'm going to sell you a bunch of shit you probably don't want, but um, you're going to have to have it anyway. Chain mail with long tabard. We could give our wife the upgraded armor, but no, she's actually pretty... I'm pretty content with what she's wearing. She looks pretty cool. Yep, you can have that extra 1600. That's fine. Oh, yeah, we'll go to every village as well. Got to make sure our vassals get troops. Now, they're not getting many troops, but, you know, they're recruiting something, which is better than nothing. Oh, we took Golden Grove. Don't actually have a clue what that is, but... A yeah, pretty happy for us, I guess. But you have you had a bunch of mounts. That's what I like to see. A bunch of wood. Yeah, we're not going to buy any more wood now. We're, we're done with wood. We're done with buying wood, I mean. Okay, a lot of uh, John Stow boots there. Let's go to Celtic Keep quickly. At this rate, my vassals are going to have more fucking troops than I am. Golden Grove. I'm assuming that's a yeah, reach settlement. Cool. Bye bye, Golden Grove. We do not want you. Do we do not need you? Get gone. Do some more trading quickly. We have two more mounts. Great. Uh, don't need any of you at the moment. We have a bunch of steel and fine steel on us. I really need to not bring that with me everywhere. I think it's because I was in a rush to, you know, go and. Uh, essentially deal with the uh, Dornish pain in the ass. That's fine. They can escape there all they want, right? You guys are actually recruiting troops here. You're recruiting the bare minimum, which is annoying, but it'll do. Yeah, we really are not going to have a lot of recruits because it looks like there are... Yeah, there are uh, Targaryens cleaning, me, cleaning them out right now. Is a little upsetting because we kind of really need the fucking troops. Right, you know what? We're going to go recruit Vale troops as well. Screw it. They're attacking Tumbleton again because of fucking course they are. Uh, ooh, Baratheon hunting spear. I don't need spear now. I'm pretty much golden on the uh, spears, you know? We should be able to have all of this armor out of our infantry soon. We do need to also need to make sure we pick up some new vassals. Uh, some new companions, sorry. And no companion there. Quickly go to salt pans. No companion here. That is perfectly fine. We'll just do a quick bunch of selling again. All of that. Cool. All of you. And that's minus seven grand. Really don't care. Right. So bloody gates. I mean, to be very specific, because I actually don't know what the Vale uh, villages are. So, it's going to take a little bit of effort to figure this out. But once we, uh, you know, now that we're recruiting from the, the Vale as well, we should hopefully have an army uh, nice and quickly. 
he says, kind of hoping more than anything. We can go to the Eerie. More trade here. Make sure we buy some horses. If there are any, there are no horses we would want. Uh, yeah. Yeah, there we go. Minus nine grand. That's fine. Money is, you know, not really a problem. Hopefully we can do this quick enough that Tumbleton I, either doesn't fall or at least, you know, doesn't fall the quickest. We are still quite actually far away from uh, having any sort of uh, troops, which is a little worrying, actually. Like we're not even at 200 men and we can have 300. A little concerning. People are escaping from Weeping Town because we don't have someone there that can, you know, look after it good enough. Hey, Hasilia has reached the age of five. Uh, she is... Or he is, sorry. Uh, he is fascinated by riddles. And he likes to care for horses. Cool, there's literally no... Oh my god, you twat, you just took everything. Like, I'm a little annoyed because I'm trying to get my forces up here, but... Yep, they took Tumbleton. That's fine. I mean, I really don't care if they take my stuff back, to be fair. Better they take it and I'll take it back later than they, uh, you know, do something else annoying, I guess. Cool. So all that. We'll go to every village as well still, because they still need to get recruits. They seem to recruit a decent amount of them here. Don't know why. There we go. To Longboard Hall. Come on. Give me troops I need. Okay, we're only just about to reach 200, 200 troops, which is great. Obviously, it'd be much better if we had over 200, but, you know, well, can't really complain. Done a lot of fighting, so, you know, you're expected to lose a lot of troops. It is what it is. Quickly go to Gold Town, sell some stuff, and then we'll move on. And we'll go back to get some Dragonstone troops again. I have a fucking unicorn. Why do I have a fucking unicorn? When did I get a unicorn? Why are there unicorns? Like... Can someone explain this to me? I know there are unicorns in uh, the lore, but like, why did I suddenly get one? Well, my wife now has a unicorn. Don't know why, she just does. And it looks like there's been people recent here, so yeah, we're not going to be able to get much. But we got something, right, we're going to quickly go back down to Bear Cave. Hopefully, uh, you know, hopefully we won't lose too much in the south, but I'd be lying if I said I had my hopes up to keep stuff, to be honest. Because it does not seem to be going that way at all. Like, yeah, we, I don't even know if we'll keep what we've got. I, as long as I keep, uh, Weeping Town, I don't care. Because Weeping Town is, uh, obviously where we've stored all of our shit, and I'd very much rather not lose all of my shit. So we're at 226 at the very least, which is good. Um, 50 free upgrades. Yes, please. Go to Duskendale. Quickly go to these towns. Grab some more horses. I mean, we have a lot of horses right now. Unfortunately, not a lot enough of them are mounts. Um, okay, minus 28 grand. That is perfectly fine. I really do not care about I do not care about the money enough to do that. Right, let's quickly get over here to uh, Missy, Massey's Hook. Point Bay, and we'll quickly do one more little, you know, swing around here, and then we'll uh, go back to war. We're not going to have a full army, but as long as I can, you know, upgrade this army really well, it's not going to matter. 
we'll quickly go back to Fellwood, and then we'll be, uh... Unfortunately, we'll have to end the part, but at the very least, we'll be ready for next to, uh, next part. Wait, did... Oh, for, no, someone escaped from Weeping Town. They didn't actually, uh... They didn't take it, which is good. Right. Cool. We're going to quickly go to... I'm going to make this part a little bit longer, because it is the last part I'm recording in this session as well. So I'd like to uh, get a few things done. Dumbleton, yep, they're going to give it to me. I'm going to give it away. Same as usual. Oh, the Cold War got instead of Royce. Surprising. All right, trade. We have, a, we have about, I'd say, a million to waste on stuff. Waste you, buy you, buy you, buy you, buy you, buy you, buy you, and buy you. We have 17 already leveled up. That's great. How much can we throw away now? How much do we need to throw away to get these guys? Fucking hell. Oh, didn't have enough. That's... Yeah, sounds about right, to be honest, unfortunately. Let's go to Weeping Town quickly, and then we'll see if there's anything that we have enough there. But we're back up to 258, which is a good number. If 639, just our army is, uh, you know... It's a start. I don't really like spending on the 200s, but, you know... If we want to get uh, anywhere with this, we're going to have to... Uh, Take the sacrifice. Yeah, iron pitchforks we'll get rid of. That's fine. I'm going to quickly go to the keep. Open the stash. Chuck you two in. Chuck all of that in uh, for now. Chuck you in as well. Uh, we'll very quickly just eat all, eat all that stuff out. Eat all that stuff out. Still don't have enough. Fucking hell. Well, we're going to unfortunately have to end this part here. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did enjoy, please do follow me on YouTube. Leave a like, leave a comment, leave a share. But most importantly, guys, stay safe. Have a great day. Join the channel memberships if you're interested. And I'll see you in the next one. See you guys then.